Hello there YouTube, Casual Yu-Gi-Oh Stuff here, back bringing you another Yu-Gi-Oh opening video. Today we have a monster mystery power box, not a monster box, it's a power box. Sorry guys, I'm still getting used to opening these awesome products. So we have a mystery power box and a couple of booster packs which we'll be opening in today's video. Uh, two Duelist Revolution 1st Edition and two Return of the Duelist 1st um, Edition, two green packs from Zexor and two green packs from 5Ds. If you're excited for the video guys, please smash the like button, subscribe if you're new, and um, basically guys, just have some fun in the comment section. And I want you to let me know for the giveaway of the video, which will be these cards right here from our previous um, opening that we did from the Mystery Power Box. I'm giving away all those pulls, so we have a Parasite Parasite, uh, Crackdown, Ib the World Chalice Priestess, Ortex Qualtus, and Mech Knight Spectrum Supreme. So these are the previous balls that we had from our other Mystery Power Box. This is the holiday version, the just the standard one for the Meta Raiders one. Uh, all that you got to let me know for the giveaway is what do you notice that's different in today's video, guys? What do you notice that's different in today's video? That's the only question I'll ask. It can be anything. It doesn't have to be the very, very obvious thing that's different in this video. Let me know if you can see. But anyway, guys, we'll have some fun today and we'll crack open the Mystery Power Box. What can we get inside? Let's have a little look. We can get a packet of sleeves, some legacy packs, hoping for an LOP pack, that would be awesome. Actually, Metal Raiders, if we can get a Metal Raiders pack and pull Beast Guard Dragon, that would make my day. Um, some other packs here, some Duelist packs, so this is what's guaranteed. Three booster packs, four Duelist packs, one legacy pack, one bonus item, one sixty player's choice of sleeves. So there we go. Sweet. Very, very cool. Um, I love the artworks of these, I'll probably keep them and never throw them away, just hoard it in my collection guys and then we're opening the pack so let's start off with the power box made a little slit in here and let's get to cracking with it there we go guys simple as that really crack open the mystery power box this is the second ever mystery power box i've ever opened so fingers crossed we can get something sweet all right so out of our mystery power box what do we have, guys? Ooh, do we have a gigantic card? Hey, that's so cool. Look, we've got a blue eyes white dragon. A gigantic blue eyes white dragon. That's pretty cool. Uh, that's sweet. Put that down. Uh, what else do we have? Hey, speaking of blue eyes, we got a blue eyes white dragon. Nice. That's one of the ones that we wanted. Ooh, okay, some more packs here. What else do we get? Wow, there's quite a lot of stuff in here. That's really, really good. Uh... That's it, I think. Yep. So here we go. Put it on the camera here, guys, with our beautiful mystery power box. Sweet. Put it on the floor next to our other one. And the sleeves that we got are these ones here. They're the premium quality player's choice card sleeves. Cool. Um, a Dragon Legend 2, first edition. Nice. Duelist Pack Yugi Unlimited. Duelist Pack Yugi Unlimited. Doors Pack Yugi, Doors Pack Yugi, would have preferred Doors Pack Kaiba, but hey ho. First edition, Secrets of Eternity, and a unlimited order of chaos. So, not too bad at all. So, Yugi packs there, Dragons of Legend, LOB, and these two packs here. Let's start off with a Secrets of Eternity booster pack and see what we can get out of this. Comes with the uh, thing this set comes with Ghost Rares, and it's not a holo guaranteed, or is it a holo guaranteed? We'll have to find out. Double Trap Hole, Infernoid Attendale. Mischief of the Gnomes, a Super Heavy Samurai, and a Gem Knight Lady Lapis Lazuli, and a Oliphors Stealth. Oliphort Health Stealth. Woo, not too bad at all. So, nice little ultra rare there, guys. Not a fan of pendulums myself, but I'll probably give that away in one of my future giveaways. Um, don't know if it's worth anything really. That's probably a question that you can tell well that you can answer in the comment section. Um, we'll go for Order of Chaos next with Chaos number 39, Utopia Ray. That's one that I do know. Comes in Ghost Rare. Comes in Ultimate Rare in this set as well. Let's see what we can get. Variable form. Flame Armor Ninja. Photon Trident. Uh, Degen Force and Over Capacity. Oh, an Insect Sword! Zect Calibre! Sweet! So another Ultra Rare, guys. That was actually really, really good. So, back-to-back -back Ultra Rare, guys. So, sweet. The luck is continuing with an Insect Spell card. I think I packed this in the box opening that I did for Order of Chaos. Inbound uh, link coming up in the description. Uh, in the little information bubble here, if you want to watch that uh, watch that video. Counter Force, um, Evo Branch, and Photon Circle. 
Sweet, guys. Two ultras out of two. Can we get an ultra from LOB? That's, uh, that'll be a good question. Should we go for some Duelist Pack Yugi now? Let's go for Duelist Pack Yugi. I'm feeling a Sorcerer of Dark Magic, personally. But I'd love a Dark Paladin. That would be so cool. Red Gadget. Big Shield Gardener. Brain Control. Karibo and Black Luster Soldier. Wow. What a typical Yugi hand that is. Cool. Uh, put that down to one side. And then we'll go for another Duelist Pack of Yugi. Funny story, if you were here back when I had about 80 to 100 subscribers, I took a picture of my first ever Duelist Pack Yugi and I uploaded it as my YouTube um, icon. So now that I've got the uh, Hinokago Sushi vs Yamato Dragon one, previously it used to be a picture of Duelist Pack Yugi. Brain Control, Big Shield Gardener again, Spellbinding Circle, Karibo, and Magical Hats. So another rare out of the second Duelist Pack Yugi. Not to worry. It'd be awesome to make some character decks out of these, actually. What I might do is build a character deck and then give it away. So anyone who's starting or getting back into Yu-Gi-Oh! who never had the character deck can have a character deck. That would be a good, a good idea for a giveaway, I think. Jack's Knight. King's Knight. Queen's Knight. Ooh, green gadget. Catapult Turtle and Card of Sanctity. So no Queen's Knight yet, but I think we can get one. Out of our final pack. Come on, Duelist Pack Yu-Gi! We need some more luck out of you. Let's see if we can get a hollow. Any hollow will do. Mirror Force will be nice. Alright, so Black Luster Ritual to go with our Black Luster Soldier from previously. Swords of Revealing Light. Light Force Sword. And another card of Sanctity with another Jack Knight. I kind of ruined that, but not to worry. Um, we'll come back with a guaranteed foil pack, which is the Dragons, Legend, Dragons of Legend 2. The chase card to get out of here, I think, is... Uh, well... There's a couple of good cards in here. When does, where does Tool Toon Kingdom come from? Is it this pack here? It might be this pack. Or it might be Dragon of Legend, the first one to get Toon Kingdom. I'm not sure. Although it will be the first card, I think. No, it won't. It's going to be the last one. So we have a Aqua Actress Tetra. Aquarium Lighting. Prediction Princess Arrow Scythe. Prediction Princess Petal Leaf. And... A Goddess Bow. So that's one of the Claw of Hermos cards. Goddess Bow. That's nice. Looks like a cool secret here. Sweet. And guys, I think it's time for our Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon pack. Here we go. Look at that, guys. Wow. We'll open it. The Legacy Pack from Reprint 2017. Legendary Collection Pack. Let's see what we can get out of our LOB. All right. And destroyed the pack. But recently, I think we, uh, we've had a lot of luck out of this set, so we're back to Trihon Dragon. If you haven't seen that video, let's see if we can do it again. Sandstone. Nemu Rico. Trip Wire Beast. And I think our hollow should be behind here, guys. It's a trap card. Do we have a trap hole? Yes, we do have a trap hole. So we did get a hole out of LOB. Sweet, guys. Trap hole. Look at that. Wow, that's really, really beautiful. The lighting looks quite good today in, in today's video. Aquamador, Yurabi, Medabat, Skull Redbird, and Manita. Look at those vanillas. But we've got a beautiful trap hole. That's great for our somewhat value back out of our box. So I think that was a pretty good box, guys. We've got some, some good hollows, two ultras, a trap hole, and a goddess bow. We'll leave that sort of here as well. And we've got our blue eyes here. But now let's move on to some Return of the Wolf packs. We'll go on to these. We'll try Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's see if we can get anything out of this one. So, guys, we have a Light Ray Medour. Medolce Mewfoy. I, I get that. Milif Milifolia. That's a, that's a dessert. Heroic Retribution Sword. A ZW Phoenix Bow. And a Secret Rare Gear Giant X. That's sweet. Look at that. Secret Gear Giant X. That's for the uh, the Giri Girigia cards and the Archetype, I think. Sweet, look at that. Secret Rare. I've never seen this card, but it looks awesome. Stonehenge, Methods, Chronomaly Golden Jet, Ninjutsu Art of Shadow Sealing, and Heroic Challenger Spartan. Wow. So, just goes to show, if you open packs, you get some good, uh, good, some good pulls. Sorry, I bit my tongue there. Um... Gear Giant X. Let's see if our next return of the Duelist can be so lucky. A return of the Duelist. Guys, I returned to Yu-Gi-Oh! back in 2017-2018.
and here we are today with the channel continuing the lock and openings it's been a massive journey thanks to all of you subscribers chronomaly mayan machine oh this is a cool one um trance the magic swordsman nice card that cool artwork where art thou this is the final well this is skull dog marin as you can see here um no, that's not skull dog marin that's a uh, Dark Crisis card. Basically, this card tells the story of, uh, of one of the cards in the uh, in the Skull Dog Marin. It's it's quite funny. And Soul Drain, nice Soul Drain. It comes in the Lost Art. That's awesome. It's good, really good rare to get. X Y Z Soul Stonehenge Gear G Accelerator Generation Force. Hey, Generation Force. That's the first ever Zaxxel set called uh, name. So we've got a Seeker out of two packs. That's normally one per box. So that's very very good. Uh, can we get something out awesome out of our final packs, which are the packs which are quite expensive. These are around 25 Maybe even 35 40 dollars each for these first editions, especially the euro packs So let's crack these open and see What we can get previously we've got some good pulls. I'd like to get Voltic, no not Voltic by one um, The Tricorn because we've, we've got both of them in in ultra rare already. Let's see if we can get like a like another one of those the final one Andres, not Andres, Jeans. Stone Stronghold Guardian, card you say uses to beat uh, Team Unicorn. Damage Eater, Scrap Sheen, and a Synchro Fusionist. Guys, what do you have behind Synchro Fusionist? It's a spell card, and it's a Scrap Yard. So, spell cards for Scrap Yards, guys. Nice. Nice little foil. Chain Whirlwind, Cursed Armorist, and AD Changer. Nice. So, we'll sleep up our Scrap Yard. What does it do? Add one scrap tuner from your deck to your hand. Simple as that. Thank you for coming. Nice. Last pack of the opening, guys. A Doors Revolution. Can we get something sweet out of our last pack? Yu-Gi-Oh! Gods! We need you. We need you now. Can you bring us something awesome? Amazon Sage. Naturia Mosquito. Barrier Wave. Ooh, Beast Rage. Scrap Golem, and here we go, guys. Behind our Scrap Golem is our final hit of the video. Can it be awesome? Can it be epic? It is a... Oh, it's a Scrap Dragon! Ultra rare! That is awesome! Scrap Dragon! Nice! We have pulled this an Ultimate Rare previously in our Duelist Revolution openings, but we'll take an Ultra Rare any day, guys. Look at that beast! We've got a Scrap Yard and a Scrap Dragon. Very, very cool. Uh, let's sleeve that up now. Um... Yeah, very, very powerful card when it came out. Everybody was using it. I wasn't dueling then, but that's what I've heard anyway. Uh, the history of this card still ho holds some value today for the scrap decks. Awesome, awesome pull. So we did pretty well out of this video, guys. So those were out of our uh, Zexal and 5Ds. Then we got some cool cards from our mystery box, which I'll probably give away in an upcoming video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please, please give it a thumbs up. Really, really means a lot and does help me, guys. Smash the um, subscribe button if you're new. And this was Casual Yugi Stuff, guys. Keeping it casual again with another Yu-Gi-Oh! opening. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye for now and peace. Yeah!